Hello and welcome to today's adventure. Now first things first, I wanted to remind everyone of our giveaway. Once we hit 100 subs, I'll be giving this Lance's Charizard box away completely for free. So be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out, and tell your friends about it. The sooner we hit 100 subs, the sooner I can give this guy away. Now, for the real adventure today, I've got a Crown Zenith Elite Trainer box. I'm so excited for this box because there are so many Crown Zenith cards that I've just been drooling over. Unfortunately, all I can really do is drool because I doubt I'll be getting any in this box. Some that I'm really excited for are actually probably the hardest to get, the four legendary Sinnoh V-Star cards. There are also so many amazing full art cards in this set, including all of these guys that form a mural of sorts. There's also a lot of cool trainer cards, some with like pseudo autographs on them that I'd really like to see in here. And of course, we've got some nice base cards and some nice Vs as well. Now, let's start opening this thing up, and I'll try to be a little bit more neat than I was before. Of course, we've got our booster packs that I'll set aside for now. Then we've got some nice cardboard dividers that we can use in here once we sort our cards out. We've got a nice bundle of energy cards plenty of energy cards to get you into battle. We've got this amazing promo card that we'll get back to in a second. We've got our code card, of course. And we've also got these amazing looking sleeves to protect our cards. These look amazing, and I might actually end up using them. We've got some cardboard condition markers, unlike the plastic ones that we got from Professor Juniper. Then we've got an acrylic V-Star marker that you can use in tournaments or battle. And of course, we've got some more click clacks to add to our ever-growing collection of click clacks in the background. We'll throw those right along, and that's it. So we'll set that stuff aside, and we'll get back to this nice promo card. This guy looks incredible. I know I said that promo cards don't belong on the Wall of Fame, but this guy almost tips the scales to go up there. What do you guys think? I'll set him aside and clear out more than enough space so we can get right into these booster packs. Now I'll just give one at random to Arceus here for safekeeping. Piplup was in charge of that last time, with Evolving Skies, and he didn't give us anything good, so now it's Arceus' turn. We'll get right in and see what we can get from our first Elite Trainer Box of Crown Zenith. Now, there's a lot more Crown Zenith stuff coming out soon, like the Shiny Zacian and Zamazenta sets. I'm looking forward to those, and depending on what I get in here, if I can ever get into here... I might buy some of those as well, and open them up for you guys. Now let's set our code card aside, take four, and get started. Again, I'm really excited for these. We've got Bisharp, Graveler, Pokemon Catcher, Chatot, Yanma, Ponyard, Bidoof, Potion, a nice Tangrowth, and Executor. So far, nothing special, but again, we've given that pack to Arceus because that's clearly going to be the best one. That's the whole reason he's in charge of holding that. Alright. We've got Energy, Luxio, Friends in Hisui, this is a cool one. I would really like the full art of that. Shaman. Galarian Meowth. Energy Retrieval. Shinx, a stinky boy. We've got Larvesta. Ponyard. A nice Luxio. And a Zer Aura V. What a great card to get so early on. That one's going aside because that makes it onto the wall. What a great start to our first Crown Zenith packs. Now we're just getting into our third pack. 
but we're already doing really well for ourselves here. Take our code card aside. We've got energy. Pokemon Catcher. Salazzle. Rare Candy. Wooloo. Helioptile. Pancham. Switch. Snorunt. Whoa, a full art Oricorio. And a Duraludon VMAX. Well, this is amazing so far. This is the best Elite Trainer box I've ever opened already. And we're only three packs in. This is absolutely incredible. Now, I've never had good luck with Elite Trainer boxes in the past. But if the rest of the packs keep going like this, who knows? Because so far, this is just insane. We'll go over everything later, because I'm hoping that there's more to go. We'll put our code card aside, take our four from the back to the front, and let's keep going. Let's keep these hits rolling. We've got an Ultra Ball, Soul Rock, Crocker Rock, Pancham, Snowrunt, Rock Ruff, Tangela or Tangela, how do you guys say it? Ball Toy, Azera Aura V Star, and Azera Aura. Holy, look at this guy, this is awesome. What a cool looking card. That, and our full art Zara Aura V, that is amazing. We've got a full Zara Aura set now. Goodness gracious. Maybe Arceus has the worst pack there <laughs> at this rate. We will keep going though and get into the next one. Who knows what's left, if there's even anything left. But this has been phenomenal so far. I've got to get more of these. All right, we've got Energy, Soul Rock, Rare Candy, Luxio, Pancham, Switch, Snow Runt, Larvesta, Tangela, a nice hollow energy card, and Double. That's a cool energy. I don't think I've ever opened a hollow energy card before. It's nothing too special, but still pretty cool. We'll get into the next booster. If we can get into the next booster. Oh yeah, there we go. You know, I think I'm getting better at opening these packs. If you watch some of the first few recordings, I can't say I opened them that well at all. But I'd like to think I'm getting better. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. And we've got Energy, Energy Switch, Crocorock, Ultra Ball, Coughing, Bidoof, Salandit, Purloin, Grubbin, Another full art Oricorio and Bellossom. That's really cool. We've got two full art Oricorios now. Maybe I'll have to give one away at some point in the future. But not before we do our 100 sub giveaway, of course. That is our first order of business for giveaways. Now we'll go into our next one. We've got four booster packs left of the 10 that this comes with. I think it comes with 10. I don't know, I haven't been counting. And I honestly didn't look it up beforehand, so that's on me. We'll set our code card aside. Now, I'd still like to see those four legendary Sinnoh V stars. We've got Salazzle, Carnivine, Girafferig, Ponyard, Cricketot, Shinx, Galarian Mr. Mime, Sunkern, whoa, a Hollow Radiant Eternatus, and Dragolage. This is a really cool looking holographic card. That is awesome. I think this counts as something that can go up on the wall, because this just looks amazing. I know it's not a full art, 
But I really like this. This looks incredible. I'm putting that one aside. Now, another one I'd like to see, though, is that full art Pikachu. Because no set is complete without a full art Pikachu, of course. There are so many of them that already exist, but we can always use more. There's no such thing as too much Pikachu. Now we'll take our four from the back and get rolling. Energy, Salazzle again, Dusclops, Matang, Galarian Mr. Mime, Sunkern, Coughing, Oddish, Salandit, a nice reverse hollow ball toy, and Luxray. We've got two boosters to go, but we've already got a ton of hits from this. I mean, this literally doubles what's already on the wall. I'd still like to see some of those, like, fake signed trainer cards that look really cool. But, I guess that might just mean I'll have to buy more Crown Zenith, and I don't see any problem at all with that. We've got Energy, Bisharp, Lunatone, Rescue Carrier, Energy Retrieval, Emolga, Love Disk, Chatot, Yanma. Whoa, a full art Cricketune! That is awesome. It looks like it's about to play music from the card itself. And <laughs> there we go! An autographed trainer card, Nessa. That is amazing. What a great booster pack. What a great elite trainer box in general. Man, those are both going up on the wall. I I like the autographed trainer cards just because of they they remind me of sports cards a little bit. And I really like sports cards and I'm sure I'll have some on the channel sooner than later. Now, we'll steal Arceus' booster pack here, thank you little guy, and see if this is the best one of the bunch, though it's going to be hard to top all of those. Alright. Now, I'll do my best to conceal whatever's inside here, since this pack was blessed by Arceus himself. We will set our code card aside. Take our four from the back to the front. And I know I'm hyping this up for probable eventual disappointment, but I cannot be disappointed with anything that comes out of this pack. Energy Switch, Crocorock, Lunatone, Energy Search, Grubbin, Skrelp, Wooloo, Helioptile, another Helioptile, and Volcarona. That is our final card. I guess Arceus didn't understand what he was supposed to do, but he left us so many other good cards that we will go back through every single one of them here. Now, we've got our Zeraora V-Star, which is phenomenal looking. Zeraora V, Radiant Eternatus, we've got the Nessa Trainer card, Two Oracorio full art cards, which look stunning. A Cricketune full art card, and of course, Duraludon V Max. What an amazing adventure we went on. I'm so glad to have shared it with you. Be sure to like and subscribe so that you guys can take some of this luck into your next adventure. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.